Hello everybody, it is your favorite monkey and welcome back to Satisfactory. And today we are, I'm just quickly going to go ahead and collect this because I have been hunting this quartz for some time now. And there we go, lovely. So welcome back. And today I was thinking we are not going to progress on anything. Instead, we are going to rebuild. And I was thinking, I think you probably saw on the title of the video, we're going to redo our whole copper thingamabob over there. And um, the reason being is there has been an ingredient we've been missing. Now with copper, you convert copper, like raw copper, that on that belt, belt. you convert that into bars. And from the bars, there are copper sheets. You can make and copper wire if i'm not mistaken why do you lag please stop lagging please and thank you and yeah some i was trying something here i just don't know what what was it it's been a while it's been a while since i have played uh took a little bit of a break and things and when i came back like yeah the game updated like the power poles like actually pretty cool but somehow it doesn't in my opinion it, they look cool, don't get me wrong, but it doesn't fit into the whole theme. You know, maybe if we can... Oh, I bet you you can recolor them. Ooh, that will be interesting. We will have to see about that in the future. <laughs> but for now, yeah, we are going to see if we cannot... I, I think I said in one of the videos we're going to fix this ugly ramp thing. Or was it somewhere else? But yeah, I'm going to... I want to do a whole episode where we do some aesthetic stuff. Um, but for now, yes, we are going to redo the whole copper smelting and... Why does it look like those guys are working? It must be an idle animation. Uh, yeah. So, we can make these copper wires and copper sheets. But there is a third ingredient that requires uh, copper, uh, but not the bars itself. We are going to make a couple of sheets we're going to trim down on most of these machines and we are going to convert some into sheets or some of these constructors into making sheets and some of these constructors into wires and the last one or last couple of machines will convert the wire into cable because cable is what is needed to make connections between power lines and whatnot and there's a couple of other things that also require the copper but yeah so i was thinking we are going to do that plus i've seen i've been watching a couple of my own episodes um and some of them were basically yeah like what's happening right now i am talking and then suddenly for 15 minutes inwards and then we cut and we come back and then the job is done we're not really doing anything together you know so <laughs> Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and try and give this a try. We are going to just start dismantling the, I've, mm, the, the smelters blow. I will, I'll do that off camera because I need to get the ratio right. But for now, let's go ahead and see if we cannot, do I have enough things just to plop into? No, I don't have rods or sh metal sheets. Hmm. Yeah, that's going to be a problem, but we are going to do away with all of these and then we will just, you know, get the copper thing running just to have the necessary copper wires, sheets and cables ready to rock and roll. And I'm going to hold off on getting some coupons. I already did get some coupons and I did already unlock a couple of things. Um, I think if we know... I think I unlocked the fence, or that's something you get. Uh, yeah, like the conveyor um, wall mount and hole, pipeline hole, uh, the power connectors over there, those kind of things, but nothing serious. And uh, yeah, so let's go ahead and just get rid of these. I'm going to start from this side. We are going to end up with a lot of materials in our inventory, but... That's part of the job. And like that. And like that. So I don't know how many of you actually watch my videos or whatnot. I'm having a blast. 
playing this game. It is literally something different. Um, I did give Factorio a try, and that was fun on its own. It's, but it's a vastly different game than what Satisfactory is. But Satisfactory, I think, is still an alpha. Experimentals and alphas. Where Factorio, I think, launched, came out of alpha and became a full-pledged game. Uh, yeah, it came out of alpha state. So, what I've done to the game is what they've done to the game. And that's going to be in it. But Satisfactory, on the other hand, there's still a couple of things that need to be added. Um, for instance, this is the experimental build. Oh, I destroyed a constructor, but that was the whole point. Um, satisfactory, they recently added the pipes, for instance, and water extractors. I can't remember seeing them in previous uh, games of previous seasons of Satisfactory. But yeah, and if you, any of you were wondering, like, this is the type of games I'm into. No, delete. I love building things, like City Skylines is another game, which I might look into in the future, in playing that, you know, that sort of things, sort of games, that is just me, that's how I like to play, oh, we are, yeah, we are, oof, that's already a lot of things, but I think that it, yeah, it will go ahead and drop, on, yeah, on the ground. But luckily, um, the ore is unlimited, so we don't have to worry too much about losing a couple of materials here and there. So, yeah. Let me go ahead and f clear up this area, and we're gonna s look up, like, a certain ratio of constructors and smelters and things just want to make sure we have enough and what we want to do is correct and we'll be right back and we are back welcome back welcome back and this is how far i've gotten so i was thinking maybe we could save some some power in uh our smelters down below by using only for eight of them okay because we have like four lines running and those are equivalent to four smelters per line okay but i was thinking we're just going to use these two and save up on the power plus we can expand a little bit later if we want Ooh, if we want to I almost step off the edge there but yeah that's just my whole thinking just why why use all that power when everything's going to get backed up when we just use two and everything is running efficiently. Plus, we are still in the early stages of the game. Well, what we've got, what we can do. I know we can expand, but I just want to keep things on par. Um, see how we can do it. And uh, yeah, so this is what we have. We've got four smelters or eight smelters below. Pushing out 120. And we have a nice conveyor lift coming up here. And this splits into six of these constructors. And these six will produce um, sheets, copper sheets. Yes, that's it. I'm just going to do this. You see nothing. <laughs> yes, we're going to do that. Uh, yeah, the first six are going to be copper sheets. And they are going to merge and get their own storage. Now, the second line over here will feed the rest, which is... In total, there's 14 of these constructors, and I, uh, brain farts many much stinky. Anyways, they're going to produce copper wires for us all the way down here. And you know, it's just going to be easy. I was using this to get some lineage, this uh, tower over here. Let's get up here. And we can now we can see better. First six are, will get their own stuff, and the rest will get their own stuff. And the last four... Yeah, the last four will 
go into two con um, constructors, almost said conveyor belts, we'll go into two constructors, which will then produce cables for us, and they will get their own line as well. So we're going to have three lines in total. I'm just going to have them drop down on that side. So maybe the two constructors can go down here, because there's space for two more. So these four will, like two will run into one, two will run into one, and that will make an S-curve, or just merge up, make an S-curve, or a U-turn, a J-turn. It'll, yeah, it'll do us a number of turns and run down that way, and that will give us some, like, yeah, yeah, stuff. For brains not work, Guys, it's one in the morning. Please forgive me. Oh. Yeah, it's one in the morning. <laughs> I keep falling. So let's go ahead and just do this together. So I want this input facing this way. That is correct. Yes, please and thank you. And this one as well. Just get the lineup. Snap to that grid. Noise. Now, you guys are going to make the cable itch. Uh, quick wire. Yeah, we will. Some point we'll do that. Uh, quick wire there, and not quick wire cable. Damn it. Okay. So that and that that's done. Now we want merges the first six will merge into. Oh, brain hurts. So I want to place one here in the middle. Yeah, it's going to lean over the edge. Okay, let's just pull back one then. Like that, like that, and like that. So now, one will be the sheets. The second one will be the wire. And the third one will be the cable. So the first three... Yeah, so let's quickly get mergers uh, down here. Mergers. So you're going to merge to this one. And let's get you... I'm going to stay as close as possible to the constructors. There. So one, two. Uh, and three. So those three... Well, no. let's get it to here, like that, you go in, into there, and you will go into there, you will go into there, that's right, so just one, two, three, and then one, two, three, so what I will do is get one here uh, just trying to get this to work okay you're gonna push out like that yeah there's gonna only be needing of three so you're gonna go no not that far like that and you're gonna go in there and you, my friend, will go in there and in there. So that and that is correct. Hmm. Okay, and then another merger. Ooh, is that going to be too tight? I don't know. Ooh. Is that bang on? I think that is bang on. So those three gets merged into here. Those three gets merged into here. Ooh, yeah, that's not... Uh. And there's no way I can make, make it fit tighter. Right? Yeah, I don't think so. Hmm. Okay, so what we can do 
is we can align this a little bit better by doing something like that. Ooh, this is not good. Not good at all, I. Eh? Because it has to make a stupid curve like that just to get it aligned. And it's not even... It is aligned properly. Why am I lagging so much? It's suddenly, it just become laggy. Probably because I'm recording. Yeah, it just shifted over to that way. And that doesn't leave room for the other conveyor belts. Unless what we can do is just go ahead and merge all of these. And get it to poop out there and just go that way, I guess. I think that's a better option. What we have now. So let's go ahead. Just, just get rid of all of this nonsense. This is easily fixable. Luckily, eh? Okay, so you're correct, you're correct. You need to do that. You can also, all these can go. Uh, the reason why I'm deleting the small bits coming out of the constructor is because usually when you play replace your merger or some kind of splitter, converger, verger, splitter, ver merger, um, it does not connect properly and then you sit with this um, little piece dangling off the side. And there's just no connection whatsoever. So easy, easy, easy. Just like that. So you connect into that. That. Like so. Like that. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. So, I want to know from you guys in the comment section. How many of you guys play this game? Because I am super curious. How many of you play this game? Do you enjoy it? Is it something you like? Just let me know. Okay. They're all merged up. Now, let us do... The next four must point this way. Hmm... Well, this last four must point into two, into these two. So I was thinking, merge these two, get a nice tight bend into here. And then same. I wonder, how does this look? Actually, not too bad. But we still, we still need to merge them. So what we can do... is get this thing to sit tight, tight, tight on this one. Like this. Get this one to come out this way. And like that. This one is just going to be a little bit more Okay, like that. And to here. Oh, that's beautiful. That's just beautiful. What? Oh, I see. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Gonna keep that one there. Yeah, I misplaced that one. Damn it! No. No! Stupid. 
<laughs> button clicking of not correctness. Keep it there. Okay, so this one. There. Okay, so you go there. Beautiful. I am so happy about that. That means you go in there. Like so. And like that. Noise. Okay. Let's quickly get these last one. Ah, like. Um, okay, yeah, that's correct. Like that. And over here. One, two, three. And then we just get you to turn this way. Yes, 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 yes. Beautiful. Just the beautiful. You go in there. Go in there. All right. All right. All right. All right. That is good, 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 good. So that one is in this middle. And it is too long. Okay, let's stand here. Let's pull it back. And to there. Alright, good, good. Okay, so, and the last one is going to be... Yeah, there's enough space here for um, getting this one run running. So you guys, you guys, you guys is gonna make the cables. And let's get rid of this. And I want a merger once again on in front of this one. Tightly packed. And you're gonna throw it out that way. Nope. Let's get you correct like that and hmm just don't want to walk off over this edge yeah that's 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 good Okay. If you pull back, just like that. Oh, nice. Nice, nice, nice. And I think it is on a sort of correct alignment towards where that one is. Do, 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 do. This is a lot of. Heavy plates. But yeah, this is working out. Good. Gotta say. And there we go. All right. So. Um, everything has. Let's just quickly go over this. There's nice three lines of the things. I uh, will just go ahead and do the storage afterwards. Oh, yes. Power cables. All right. Okay, so it's going to be actually easy with the power cables. What we need to do is just... That. You go there. You go there. And you. Go there. You know, the more I look at these power lines, these new power poles, the more I'm starting to like them. There's actually nothing wrong with them. They fit in very well. 
I used to think like, but why? And then it was just like, okay, now it, it looks better. Okay, this one is not gonna work out so well. Okay, that one's not connected, so these two, like that, like that. And use use gonna go here's eyes. Uh, yeah, that's not gonna work. Can't afford. Oh, why? Oh, can we? Oh, that was a lucky save. <laughs> All right, so we need more. Uh, let's grab some rods and some wires, copper wire. It should be good. We should have that. Up here. Oh, yes, there's something I want to show you guys. Something I want to show you guys. <laughs> Look at this thing. <laughs> this is the best. <laughs> and it moves. It really goes. <laughs> it's got a huge turning radius. Oh. <laughs> This is the best. Just don't go too fast off ramps because this will happen. There we go. <laughs> I want to use this to get around everything. No. As quickly as possible. But it's just so hard to control. No. <laughs> All right, let's just get that annoying sound off and just try this again. But yeah, and it's so small, you can fit in anywhere. And the braking power. Like, oof, those G-forces. <laughs> Your face is gonna be planted in that front windshield. Like, just splattered all. Ah! Little buddy, you okay? Okay, this is where we made a mistake. It's just, yes, there we go. But just remember, if you go on a drive with this thing, try to stay on your base. If you go off-road or whatever, it's super slow. It's really slow. There we go. <laughs> Cute little thing. Alright, what were we doing? <laughs> Alright, that. Um, did I have overflow over here? I don't think so. Oh yes, I do. There we go. Nice. And let's get back. So I went from this foreman office sort of branching out on things just so that um, it's easier not to run down all the time on that ramp. You know, if I want to go to the copper, I can go to the copper. If I want to go to the iron, I go to the iron. Easy as that. That's what I want. This is just a little bit... Uh, let's go around too far. I don't like it too much. It's, it's really getting to me. Let's put it that way. It's just too much, man. It's too much. Too much to handle. All right, where were we? All right, oh, wow, okay, cool. We were, <laughs> we were here. You. Let's go to the next two, which will be here. There. There. And then these two. Yeah, that's not gonna fit. So we're just gonna plant you here. There. There. And you will be powering these last two. And you're also not going to fit. Wow. Okay. There and there. I'm just going to put a power pole just over here, just for now. Just get this working. So everything should have power. Got your wires. Uh... Let's just go through all of these before we switch on the machines down below. You know, I have to double check everything. Can't just like expect everything to work once. It's just silly, just silly. Well, in my case, it is just silly. I have to double check everything. Otherwise, if you forget something and just like, why is it not why? Why is it not producing? It's because you forget to choose the recipe, you bloody fool. Oh, okay, sorry. Jeez. Alright, that's good, that's good. Let's get down here. Okay. Let's go ahead and switch on. 
One, two, three, four, you, you, number three, and number four. I think these guys, yeah, they are, they, they are not connected. Okay, so they are running. Let's go up top and check other things. Ooh, I can see from my recording everything's starting to lag. And that's probably because, because it is, it is probably lagging. Ooh, I can hear machines working. Ooh. All right, there they come. So we should be seeing everything getting a full load right about now. And yeah, you guys are still waiting. Yeah, see now the gaps are getting smaller. Yeah, you're, you're not working correct. Damn it, we spent all this time. For what? For what? Oh, this is really confusing. Let's get that out. Uh, I just want to see. Maybe I got something wrong. Maybe I should actually go ahead and just insert another um, line here. But, um, yeah, there we go. Well, these guys are done, actually. And here comes the cables. So, yeah, I think this is a good place to put a cut. Thank you so much for joining me here on Satisfactory. Hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.